You do realize you don't need to stand behind me all the time, don't you? You can come and sit beside me. Why would that be strange? You've heard people saying those things, have you? They aren't true, you know. I'm not some kind of living saint. I suppose it's understandable that some people want to believe that. They want to believe that someone can truly save them, but no one can save them. Not the way they need to be saved. Least of all, me. To be honest, everyone would be better off if they let that hope die out. Sorry, that was... That was rather gloomy, wasn't it? I do apologize. You... You've probably noticed that I haven't been the most... Welcoming, haven't you? I am sorry about that. I... I've been having some difficulties adjusting to this life recently. Especially since I left behind a friend when I came here. Did you have that same experience? You didn't. Were you... Were you alone when they brought you here? You came... Freely. You wanted them to see your power. You're braver than I am. And certainly more accepting of yourself than I am. What do I mean? I was hiding my power before. Because I wanted to stay with one of my friends. I... I couldn't let go of the feeling of wanting to be normal. Of wanting to... Not be the Sun Summoner. I couldn't let go of that feeling. For a long time, and... And because of that, I couldn't summon... Without the Darkling's help. Or without Bagra's help. And, of course, as soon as I did let go of that feeling, as soon as I let go of him, things changed. I began to use my power freely, and... And I noticed that... I started to feel happier, almost. But recently... That's changed again. Why? I've heard that some of the soldiers have been sent to look for... a myth. A creature that only exists in legend. And, from what I've heard, they're being sent rather close to Fjada. Which, as I'm sure you've noticed, isn't the safest place for people like us. People who... People with our powers? Or people who know people with our powers? Yes. Yes, I do wonder if... If my friend was among them. But I don't wonder enough to want to be with him. Nor do I worry about him enough to wish that I was there to keep him safe. Part of me feels relieved for being able to let him go. Do you know why? He was to me a lot like you are to yourself. I've noticed the way you move, the way you hesitate before showing your power to anyone. 
you're scared of it, aren't you? Maybe even a little ashamed? That's okay. It's okay to feel that way at first. But you've known about your power for a long time, haven't you? You use it like you've been using it all your life. You know what you're doing. You... You know that you aren't going to hurt someone with that power unless you actually try to. What I don't understand is how you can hate yourself for having that power when it's kept you alive all these years. When it's kept you from ever getting sick, from ever feeling exhausted. I don't understand how you can be ashamed of it when it's been helping you for so long. I felt ashamed of mine because... because I wanted my friend to... I wanted him to feel the same way about me that I do about him. I wanted him to love me. And he... He always said that he hated Grisha, but then... Then I found out that he slept with one of them. He tumbled a Grisha before I discovered what I was. And then he looked at me like... Like I'd betrayed him. He looked at me like... Like I was a monster. As if he hadn't... As if he hadn't spent the night with a girl who broke my ribs later on. I just... I thought he could love me if I was like him. If I was normal. But he didn't. So I let go of him. And you need to let go of the part of yourself that is so ashamed of what you are. It's... It's freeing. It truly is. But I don't understand how you can suddenly be so... So timid. After all, with your power, you could... You could do so many things. No. Saints, no! I don't mean to say that you could do horrible things, so why be afraid of people? Or afraid of yourself. I mean... You could... You could be like General Kirigan. You could... You could be someone truly great, with a power like yours. People like you are in short supply. People like me as well. With our powers, there's no telling what we could do. We could change the world. We could. Maybe for the better, maybe for worse. But we could change it. Granted, we won't be the living saints people think we are, but... But we could come close. We could be something close to what they want us to be. Don't you want that? But what? Why can't you just... Bagra told you something. Whatever she told you, I'm certain she didn't mean it. She says plenty of horrible things to me. She says it to get us riled up, okay? She says it so that we... She told you the truth about her power. What do you mean? 
she showed you what she is? Well, she is a living amplifier, but I don't... She's like you? And General Kirigan? But I thought... I thought only his bloodline could... She's his mother, isn't she? And you... You must be related to him, then. Did she tell you that, too? Then... Then why does that make you fear your power? Shouldn't that make you leap with joy? You're related to General Kirigan. He created us. He let us have the little palace. He created a world in which we aren't feared. He can... No. No, that can't be true. He can't be... How do you know this? Bagra told you... what he did. He created... the Shadowfall. Come with me. No. No, I believe you. That's why I think we need to speak about this in a more private setting. Come with me. We're going to my room. And then you can tell me exactly what she told you. All right? <laughs>